Hey there, John Ferguson, Smart here. A common question that I often get is, how do you fit in BDD collaboration practices? How do you fit in having conversations about requirements with the business before you start working? Often, as a developer, I'd like nothing more than just to dive into the code and start working. But the thing is, here's a little secret about software development. The hardest thing is not the actual writing of the code. Writing code is only tricky when you don't have clarity about what to write. That's when you write more code than you need. That's when you build more stuff than you need. That's where you build, do a lot of, spend a lot of time reworking and fixing things that you didn't understand initially, simply because you didn't take the time to get clarity around what you need to do. Now, Agile is a balance. Agile is all about getting clarity when you need to get clarity, but not falling into the trap of thinking you can understand everything up front without actually trying it out. You've got to have fast feedback cycles. You've got to be able to build something and see whether it works and get feedback from the customer. But to build that thing, you've got to get clarity about what you're trying to do or what problem you're trying to solve. And that clarity comes from these conversations that you have when you're doing a practice like behavior-driven development. Having Getting that clarity, getting that understanding is essential to speeding up your delivery and doing less work later on. So you're getting clarity at the start of the process. And I mean, at, before a sprint starts, you sit down, you have conversations and you get a better understanding of what you need to do so that you can save time further on down the track. And it's got to be seen to be believed. You've really got to try it out to actually make it happen. So what I would suggest to do is if you're getting started with BDD, if you're getting started with these, even Agile, try these practices on a single story at the start. Just don't try it with everything. Do it, just do thing BDD properly. And I mean, do the proper collaboration for a single story in a sprint. See how that goes. See what sort of... Uh, conversations you need to have, what sort of language you come up with, what sort of ways you find to express your requirements, and then build on that in the next sprint. See, get get in, get some quick sc uh, scores on the on the board, and then move forward to build on that and and maybe do it for two stories or three stories, but start gradually, and you'll find that the time that you spend initially. Getting that clarity pays off for itself many times over by the time that you save further on in the sprint. Thanks for listening, folks.